Okay, so real quick, I'm going to go over um, how to put these things onto Google Podcasts. So the way how I did it was um, I put up these four little things because um, ultimately I just wanted to use this as a good way to study because I, I can speed up the volume, I can download it onto my phone, play it really anywhere. Um, I can delete this at any time, but so what I did was I uploaded these things to begin with underneath the upload page, pretty easy, straightforward. Then I click edit, um, and this is what you have to do with the first couple of files. You need to make sure you click include RSS feed. This is the most important thing and one of the hardest things to remember. Then you, after you did that, you click save, and then you go over here to your settings. And then you click on, I believe it's content. Yeah, it's content. Then you set up your RSS field. That's where you would include all of this information and stuff. Um, and then click save. Then from there, you would copy your RSS field. And you go over and look up real quick. Um, the URL is really hard to find. So I just look up um, Google Podcast Upload. And then I think it's here. I might be wrong. Let me pause it real quick. I was wrong on that link. I think it might be this one. Yeah. From there, you would, if you were to make a brand new podcast, it would have all this information about the RSS field. Then from there, you would copy and paste it. And the whole process takes about three days because they have to physically verify it. It's quite hard. Now, this already exists. So, since I already have this up, um, when I want to update the episodes, what I do is that I just update the episodes over here. And apparently, it automatically puts in the brand new episodes. Um, so, right now, those three are published, and this one is still processing. So, when I pull that up onto here, um, when I reload it, it shows these couple brand new episodes. Now these four, these four are older, but these brand new ones are well new because SoundCloud only allows a limit of four before you have to start paying monthly. Um, ultimately, I did this because I wanted to see if I could um, theoretically, because I know a couple of businesses and churches who would like to upload podcasts, and I figured I might as well learn the skill. I can delete this at any point in time. No one else has listened to this stuff. I've already checked the numbers. Um, so I just thought I'd share this with you in case you ever wanted to look into adding podcasts to your lesson plans. So thanks for your time.